CMD Boxing Reports, Ronell Hill reporting here, and I am back at it for the Boxing Fanatics. So, throughout Lennox Lewis's career, a lot of people never gave the man the credit he deserved. He was called the big pussy cat. People made fun of the way he talked, you know, uh, because over here in America, we looked at our heavyweights as, you know, always thorough, mostly like Mike Tyson, you know, uh, guys with the like attitude, I guess. And, and Lennox Lewis, he had that, you know, uh, how can I say, like very polite uh, accent with him. You know, a, a lot of people thought it was feminine and stuff, but who cares? I mean, I always liked Lennox Lewis style. You know, I thought he was always a great fighter. And a lot of people, like I said before, including the uh, boxing networks, uh, mostly HBO, they never gave the man credit and still to this day they are not giving him credit so check this out lennox lewis had tweeted this so apparently showtime thinks they can rewrite history by writing champions like myself bo douglas and holyfield out of it by saying there hasn't been an undisputed champion since mike tyson in 1999 i personally recall facing holyfield for that honor twice he continued as a fighter being the undisputed champion was my only goal fight the best to be the best that was the legacy i fought my whole career for so don't think i'll take it lightly when showtime tries to take that away from me or anyone else who deserves that honor and that is so true i mean back then evander holyfield and lennox Lewis, that's all they talked about was being undisputed they didn't you know they wanted to fight the best they wanted to fight every champion money was not an object i mean it, it was something you know but they wouldn't say well i'm not gonna fight this guy for this amount of money hells no what they wanted to be was the king of the ring that's all they cared about and it's a shame that showtime is doing this i mean they should you know bring it back and write the history correct okay to let people know how boxing used to be so, like I said, they never gave, you know, an old time great like Lennox Lewis his props anyway. However, I, I am a Lennox Lewis fan. You know, I liked his boxing, like I said before, especially when he had took on Andrew Gulotta. I mean, over here in the States, he was mostly an, an underdog because, you know, Andrew Gulotta, he had that, that power and the way he steamrolled uh, Reddick Bow. They thought, you know, that, that same thing would happen with Lennox Lewis, but hey, my boy, he proved otherwise. But anyways, that's my take on this CMD boxing reports and I'll catch you guys on the next one.